Hello, welcome back to the IBL South by Southwest Expert Showcase. I'm Sean, and I'm sitting down with the very interesting, I've had the pleasure of chatting with her for a moment here, Gabriella Wong. Uh, Gabriella, you're doing a couple things here, but today we really wanted to highlight uh, your startup, Access SOS. I think I'm saying that right, but fantastic. And we'll talk about that as well as you also have a South by panel of your own that you'll be doing, a conversation called We're Spending Billions why we don't feel safe. And so, Gabriella, you obviously have a wealth of knowledge and wisdom, uh, specifically around you know, security and safety and, and, and this, but I wanna hear, tell me about Access SOS first. Tell me about what you're excited about, what you guys are working on. Give us the lowdown. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So, my talk is we're spending billions but we don't feel safe. Yeah. And where I fit into this ecosystem of not feeling safe is um, talking about what happens when we are in an emergency yeah. and we need help. Yeah. Because um, that's the first part where you're in a really critical situation. Maybe you're alone. You need help. You yeah. don't feel safe, right? Yeah. And so, what I work on is there are huge amounts of um, Americans that are left out of this yeah. emergency system because they can't hear mm. or speak out loud. Yeah. And what, what that means is the 911 system in the United States was built on a landline system. Okay. And dispatchers, yeah. they speak English yeah. and they hear. And so the populations that are left out yeah. are usually deaf and hard of hearing folks, mm. people who can't speak English, yeah. people who are in a really scary situation yeah, that can't that's talk out loud. Even um, you and I, if there's a lot of noise and we're trying to talk with a dispatcher, yes. they won't be able to hear us. It's an overwhelming feeling. Exactly. So yeah. that's, what I, that's what I focus on, making I emergency that. help accessible. That's so important. That's, how did... How did you get connected with that? What was kind of the, the, the impetus of that? Um, the, the impetus, the catalyst to it was um, both my parents are deaf. Oh, okay. And sign language is my very first language. Very cool. Yeah. Love that. Yeah. And um, I didn't realize it was a, a problem yeah. until my dad had a medical emergency. Mm. He was home alone, and he ended up texting me to call 911 for him. Oh, wow. And I wasn't near my phone at that time. Wow. And that's when I realized text to 911 it wasn't available yeah. in our, our home, in our county, mm. and that how could my dad contact 911 for help yeah. if he can't speak or hear them? That's so scary. Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry you went through that. But I'm, 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 I love the fact that this has become a passion of yours. And so what are you guys up to with Access SOS? What have been some of the things that you're trying to get off the ground by now? Yeah, yeah. So we are a tech nonprofit startup. Yeah, yeah. And so technology is the core to our problem solving. Yeah. Um, so we have a mobile app that translates text into a 911 phone call. Mm. Um, it's in real Very time. Cool. It's at, at scale. And yeah. it's available in multiple languages. And wow. we're launching in New Mexico next week. Which what? Like, yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Super. So you got a lot of things going on right now. That yeah. Keeping your head above water. I love that. I think that's, I mean, it's obviously something we can all get behind and rally around. Um, okay. Fantastic. So talk about uh, the, the, the actual conversation you're having today, uh, sorry, tomorrow at South By. Um, it, what, are, what are you hoping people are going to walk away understanding that maybe they didn't for the first time? So I'm on an amazing panel yeah. with um, Dave Shi, Andre, mm -hmm. and we all um, are social innovators. Okay. Um, so we um, have entrepreneurship in yeah. our, you know, we that's yeah. what we do. We love to solve problems. Yeah. But with that 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 framework of social good totally. and changing the system that leaves out millions of people. Yeah. And so I want to give everyone access and understanding of we need more social yeah. innovators in this space yeah. and so we want to inspire new change makers to come into this yeah. space especially people with lived problems of mm. the solution who understand the solution sure gone through it understand it from a unique vantage point I think that's so good and I, I, I love that well I'm, I'm very excited to hear how your South by showcase goes and and is there anything else you want to share with the the Ibble community uh, anything you want to plug I mean obviously next week the big launch yeah yeah, yeah follow us um, How can they get connected? Yeah, follow my um, my organization's Instagram, 911 Access. We're on Twitter, LinkedIn. Yeah. Um, hope to see you there. I, I love that. I do want to get better at sign language. I, I don't really know it. I know one phrase. You're going to laugh at me. Uh, 
uh, my name is Sean and yes. I love bacon. Oh my uh, God, I love that. Uh, <laughs> That's great. Oh, thank you, thank you. I, 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 I do want to get better at this, though. No, I think it's no, so important. I think that, that's, yeah. that's great. I, I always get so stoked at a lady when I see people sign. It's, oh my gosh. Should, yeah, you should develop it more. I absolutely will. Well, thank you so much. You're doing great work. You're doing great things. Give them some love. Access SOS. Gabriella Wong, thanks for joining us today. Thank we you, really Sean. appreciate you. You thank bet. You. All right, guys.